Hello everybody, this is Budrich and I have spent the whole damn day here, almost. I made some food, I also played some magic, but uh, most of the time today I have spent with this stupid, stupid day 10 puzzle here. I, I cannot uh, figure out how to do it. I guess I am officially filtered on advent of code. I, I don't know. Uh, I haven't really looked up any answers uh, to it either. I, I cannot wrap my head around this. Let, let me show you where what, what's going on, wh where I'm stuck. This is day one or part one because I have I sold the first part. It was e super extremely easy actually the first part. But then the second part, <laughs> it's too complicated for my brain. I don't understand. Um, it, it's also a really ridiculous <laughs> story behind this. Uh, how, what's going on in the in the calendar here? But uh, apparently the main character. I don't know who it is really. If it is Santa or it if is like one of his hacker elves or something. But they are stuck on a plane or something like that, and uh, he wants to connect uh, a device he has. Uh, so we have a, a bunch of these uh, uh, adapters, like power adapters. And they have quite a few adapters, and they have different uh, jolt uh, ranges, so whatever. And you can see here is these are all the adapters you have. Imagine these are like power cord adapter connectors. And they have different numbers here. And he wants to connect it to a socket and that socket have zero jolt uh, output. Uh, and that means it can only connect it can connect to uh, an adapter with uh, the jolt power value thing here. That's either one, two, or three. Uh, so somewhere in this list, there is uh, here we have one, for example, that would work to connect with it, and there's probably two and three also. I don't know. Um, whatever. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I want to make this output this longer. You can see I made this beautiful, I even added colors now to the program. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense anyway, so as you can see I've done some... Try to convert uh, my answers to binary, to, just to see if there is a pattern there. You know, I'm going a bit insane here. So the problem here uh, is to find all possible connect, uh, ways you can connect these power cords. Uh, from zero to the last... Uh, um, to the last uh, here, here it's a good good way to see what it's about this is a short uh, input let me we can bring it up uh, maybe we can do what happens if we do here nothing I'm not monitoring that um, do here Echo and then we just exit out here. There, this is a sorted list because I I think it's a good a good idea to sort it, or I'm pretty sure. And then we have zero. That is the actual socket where we start connecting. Uh, and this is example two. Is it example? one that is yeah this is the short one and here are the po different uh, uh, ways you can connect this one eight different uh, um, eight different uh, 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 number of arrangements so we can connect one to zero of course and then four to one because it's three bit in between these numbers we can connect four to five because it's one between these and so on you know but you can skip some of these. Uh, for example, uh, we can remove here. I think here they have removed 11. You don't need 11 really. You can connect uh, straight from, from 12 to 15 or 10 to 12 here. That is what they have done here. So then you get variations because of that. Um, you can also remove 
5, I believe, it's done here, and 6 can also be removed in this uh, example list here. But this is like the easy, super easy example, really short series, and then it's uh, apparently 8 uh, different uh, ways the, you can connect the, these adapters. Then there is this uh, slightly longer uh, list example list here, example 2, which looks like this. It's not that much longer, but according to this, the number of uh, uh, variations here is now 19,208. You know, it's kind of easy with this first example to uh, um, backtrace and see what the, how it works. But here, I, I, I basically have no idea uh, how to figure out this puzzle uh without frying my cpu i actually got a couple of sig faults from bash here uh, while this has been <laughs> it's more than a trillion is it is the actual input because this this is just example input the actual uh, uh thing we we are supposed to parse is this guy here you know and that's a lot of numbers uh so so the answer to that series is over one trillion, and uh, it, it hints here that uh, that there must be a, a more efficient way than just looping each of these and testing, you know, what the variations. I, I have no idea how to do it uh, really. I thought this was what I was uh, going for uh, for a long while here, because in this example. The ones that can get removed here, or that are removed in, in here, are 5, 6, and 11. And there is a pattern to this here. You see 4, 5, 6. 5 is in between uh, two consecutive numbers here. 6 is in between two consecutive numbers. 11 is in, in between two consecutive numbers and no other numbers are like that and I thought hey I found it this is the answer if I just find the number of triplets like this one uh, one triplet two triplets and three triplets for this uh, uh, this list here this one then I have kind of solved uh, the puzzle, but uh, that wasn't really the case at all. Because then, then I know, okay, if there are three triplets, then those three can get, uh, is what can vary. So it's it's really just, uh, I don't have to care about all, all of this, uh, just thinking about the those three uh, possible variations. Uh, and then you could almost, uh, you can see here also, I made some notes here. I, I started, I went uh, cocoa banana here, you know, started writing bit, uh, <laughs> bit masks by, uh, by hand like this, just to see what happens. It, but in one way, you know, if it is three, three possible guys that can change, we got this guy, we got uh, this guy, we got this guy. This guy, this guy, no, we already got him. That, that, god damn it, it feels like I forgot something. We also got this, I guess, and uh, haven't done that right. How many do we have here? Eight. This, this is the, the, this is the answer to, and this was how I thought you could solve uh, any number. This also happens to be. Uh, if you take um, three bit shift, or if you bit shift one by three, the answer will be eight also, because that is uh, this. Um, And same in my my study here, uh, I also found that that works for four as well. You can pitch shift four, and it will uh, uh, result in um, sixteen, which I think is the number of possibilities for four uh, that can get moved around. But this isn't correct. This isn't correct. And also only got this uh, 
list of eight or the other example where the answer is uh, like 19,000. I don't know here what, what that is supposed to mean. Now I think I lost those notes because I started doing math on that uh, that um, number, the answer here. Well, here I got something. Yeah, here I have written down. I found 14 triplets, uh, series of trees in in uh, the example here, this one. But it might also be that it's 15. Because I don't think when I did this calculation, I didn't count this first one. And I think maybe I should. I, I, I'm not sure. I'm going crazy. And I really want to solve this uh, also. Uh, <laughs> and I. It's 14 trips, and then the answer, because I know the answer, it's uh, printed on the on the website here, you know? So I know this is the correct answer. I don't know how to get there. So I just, just started doing things like this. So what's, uh, what's the answer divided by 14? And then I got a really round and nice number. I think maybe 19208 divided by 14. Yeah, you see, it's an integer number. So I thought, hey, hey, there is something here. And then I started doing stuff on this number and found that this, this worked. So uh, 14, ah, I don't even remember how I did this. So, so the number of trips divided by two is equal to seven. Uh, And seven is also the magic number that led me here somehow. 14 times 14 divided by this. And this times 14 is the answer. And you know, there is, it looks like there is a pattern here, but there isn't. I tried it with the other numbers. It just doesn't work. I, I don't know. Uh, I, I think I was just found some magic number. I, 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 I don't know. And I spent, spent a lot of time on this. I don't even remember now my, my train of thought there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this, this doesn't make any sense. Or maybe this is, I, I don't know anymore. I don't know anything. I tried so many things here. I tried to uh, figuring out the shortest path and the longest path and um, I don't even know anymore. You see here, I got the shortest path, longest, and then I start. Maybe it's uh, if I the difference here, you know, the sum. Uh, now I test it here with thirteen. Well, let's say, let's say it is fourteen. Uh, maybe it is like if if I loop the sum uh, so fourteen times, and then every time I multiply the sum with itself or something. Maybe I don't know, and then add that to some total, and I got kind of closer. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It feels like this might be something, but I'm starting to doubt this uh, triplet method completely that it has nothing to do with that because it can also be like, uh, it doesn't have to be triplets. You can see it here in this uh, diagram here or this um, whatever that it doesn't really have to be a triplet. To, to be removed, even if all of these are in triplets. I guess, because here I'm not really looking for triplets. The first first time I, 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 I did this, I, I looked, looped every number and, and tested if the previous and next one existed, kind of. Uh, and that is like pure trips. But here I'm just testing for the first, when I'm finding the shortest path here, and it kind of gives the same result because, well, yeah, here's a trip, here's a trip, here's a trip, no trips, here's a trip, here's a trip. Well, there are actually more trips than this because here I thought we got the longest and the shortest possible chain the difference between them 
should be the number I should use as a variation variable kind of thing. I I, I don't know. I have no idea. I, I, I've spent so much time on this now, so I am, I am actually uh, uh, further away from the uh, solution, I feel, than I was when I started. Uh, I have gone and I, I, I also this day I really had stuff to do I I, I will have to spend them um, there will be no sleep this night I have to do do things um, stupid advent of code or maybe stupid budridge I, I I don't know um, I don't know if, uh, what I will do here uh, I think I actually think I, I, I kind of have to do that. Uh, I'm making this video now. I think I would put it up there. Uh, if someone got the answer, that would be uh, the nice. Uh, yeah, get some dialogue about this. Uh, uh, but I will probably just look up the answer to this uh, to move to be able to move on with my life. But I feel bad. But this this was uh, I, I cannot just I, I just can't wrap my head around it. I don't figure out how to calculate for all the variations because you know there's one variation if I take the first here we, we got a choice immediately here we got we actually got three different branches that the chain can take here from just the first adapter and each of these branches uh, in turn can also be be varied in and that is why the number is so insanely high you know but I don't know the formula re really for how to see all of those branches without just not just brute forcing it but the thing is I, I don't really I, I, I cannot really wrap my head around how I would brute force it either in a sane way you know or it will not be a sane way but without having like four nested four loops with yeah I don't know and it will pr probably not even work and probably take like hours to <laughs> to get an answer if it would work and then it will probably not work anyways and I would have to do it again it takes hours I cannot do that you know I don't know I don't know so so it branches off here and then it comes to to the next adapter okay here we got multiple uh, options here as well I think the numbers here are the available options so there are three uh, different adapters here to, to this one for example I can connect two I can connect three and I can connect four to this and two have two available connector connectors three and four uh, and I don't know is and this is also it, it, it's like it just my, my in my brain when I start thinking about it it, it just like no you, you you cannot think like this stop it's like because I want to want to think like uh, so if I choose here four will I be able to even continue there if I don't uh, or something like that I, I don't even know I don't even know if I feel I'm getting stupider and stupider uh, the longer I spent on this it's um, god damn it god damn it okay but at the same time this is the fun stuff you know uh, when when you hit when you hit your limit it, it has been really really easy uh, in my opinion advent of code even the difficult ones have been it, it, it's been like face palms uh, when when i solve them anyways it's it's like ah oh, i i just I, I misread the instructions you know but this this is a tricky for, for me uh, uh problem let's see i i have probably spent like five active hours on this today uh, we look at the leaderboard we can look at day 10 yeah the fast, fastest person solved both solved these issues in two minutes that's uh, pretty pretty good but we can see there's a big difference here so this tells that this was actually a, a difficult puzzle and this is quite high times here this is the most difficult puzzle, I believe. Eight minutes is, that's quite long time on top uh, 100 here. Yes, we can also see how many got filtered. Not that, ma well, it is actually also, you can see the silver stars, that's part two of this puzzle. Part one was extremely easy. 
uh, part one was like day one easy, but part two here, uh, we can see that that's the biggest, uh, by far the biggest gap. Uh, 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 because now the puzzle has been up for for 15 hours or something. Yeah, maybe I've spent uh, more time than five hours. I don't know. I don't know anymore. I don't want to be. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to do this. Uh, but it is, of course, possible to just skip this and uh, move on here. I just have to live with I'm not having the second gold star here. I guess. Okay, so eight hours, uh, supposed to sleep and stuff. Skipping, sleeping, skipping, Elven to code. Now, I, I give up for this now for today and I will, uh, tomorrow, I will be extremely tired, do the puzzle, uh, try to do the puzzle at least, and um, then I will go directly to sleep and, and turn upside down on my sleeping schedule because whatever. Um, so I don't know if anyone else is doing this advent of code stuff here, especially in Bash, but I, I, I don't blame Bash whatsoever. Uh, this is me who, who just, I, I'm sure it can be solved with Bash. This, uh, the language is not what hinders me here. It's my ability to grasp uh, the, the problem really. Um, and usually it feels, you, you can feel that you are on the right track, so to speak, you know, even if you get completely wrong answers, but here, no, I, I have no idea. I'm just trying stuff. I'm just, maybe there's something with this, you know, maybe <laughs> I, I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, yeah. Um, have a, have, whatever. 